Well, the Pensacola Boy Scouts getting closer to reaching Eagle status, all thanks to a project that he hopes will improve the overall well-being of the Gulf and keep tourists coming back to our beautiful beaches. The CW55's Haley Minogue, she spoke with the scout, as well as some beachgoers, about the importance of beach cleanliness. Paper bags and um, a lot of food waste and cigarette butts mostly. When Boy Scout Connor Stewart talks about the garbage he's seen on the beach, it's easy to see why he decided to do something about it. And I got seven people to come over, and we built the boxes, and uh, we painted them, and then we installed them. Connor wants to become an Eagle Scout. Leadership in this project will help him get closer to that goal, but overall cleanliness is the main motivation. When you go out there, you, you want to see like a perfect white beach and have the wildlife happy and not all messed up and um, when you see like a ton of dirty stuff it's not as enjoyable and it kind of ruins everything. Having these boxes on the beaches also eliminates the ability to make an excuse. If you've got access to them and you're not using them, well that's on you. Oh, I think it'll help because if somebody did forget to bring something they may leave it behind and that might help them to be like all you got to do is put it in there. I'm sure it'll help people people who didn't think to bring a trash bag with them. Visitors notice the cleanliness. It's one of the reasons why they choose Pensacola Beach. Half of the vacation is going to the beach, so I mean, if we're going to get in the water and play in the sand, I'd like it to be like trash free. Leaving only my footprints on Pensacola Beach, Haley Minogue, the CW55 News at 9. And hey, the boxes have been really popular so far. The bags have had to be replaced several times already. And with Christmas now just a fond memory, it's time to start